one of the best things about this expedition is that we have scientists from different parts of the world we have people from russia we have people from us we have people from italy we have people from india china and this is something which is very interesting i mean when you when we eat together when we talk together when we discuss about our issues and about our science and how we are doing in our daily life it, it's really amazing and it uh, you get a clear picture of the whole world in just a small a point in an ocean that's very interesting yes it's a unique way to access deep portion of the earth and uh, it's crucial to understand plate tectonic motion but also climate uh, change through time and we had huge discoveries with IODP like oceanic crust major extinction and deep deep sea life it's, uh, an international collaboration on board it's an amazing platform it's an amazing atmosphere like uh, people working all together coming from all over the world it's uh, an international and human experience a very amazing human experience i will miss the possibility to have uh, an international team all on board a research vessel for two months at a time and to make such great contact with the best scientists in their respective field. I will miss uh, uh, about this uh, expedition. The people I met uh, were uh, really special and uh, probably they will miss uh, most of these of all this yes people the new friends work together and uh, defeat the same problem it's very amazing will miss about joyous resolution i will miss uh, the multicultural atmosphere that we have here that's true mix of different experiences different uh, cultures different heritages different languages we all have accents here and that's absolutely awesome this is not only new science that is generated here. We also train a lot of young scientists here and that is a laboratory that uh, allows them to start their career, to have a foundation for their career and we are going definitely miss that. that the environment, you can do a lot of good work on a scientific po point of view but also have very close relationships and you realize that most of our job is actually coming from our uh, will to stay together and to try to do science with other person. If we are alone, science doesn't mean anything. That, that, that's my personal view. Started uh, my PhD working on the Ophiolite and I started to go into IODP like a very external person. I started to do some school and then I realized that it, it's the best program ever done for the science. It's better than every other program in science. And now in my activity, I do most of my work and science related to IODP. The ability to do science, the international collaboration that you can have, the facilities that are unique because you can access to some facility that you don't, we will not find anywhere. And the next program will be different. I'm gonna miss uh, the sense uh, of community among the scientists, but not only with the technicians and everyone who is actually working towards having a successful expedition. On a more personal point of view, it's great to see rocks that nobody else have seen. And uh, when there is coron deck, I love looking at, uh, you know, what is in the core liner and thinking that uh, in a few hours I will be the one actually splitting the course and describing it. That's uh, actually quite uh, emotional in a way because, uh, yeah, I mean, the, the idea that uh, my hands are going to be the first one touching is, is great. IADP uh, in general, I think that there has been a great opportunity for all Earth scientists and beyond, actually. Uh, is a great opportunity for young scientists, uh, is a great opportunity for more senior scientists. I, I got uh, on board uh, as a very junior scientist, now I'm here as um, a senior scientist. And uh, I would say that uh, Joy this really changed my way of uh, looking at uh, how science is made because uh, it, it's an environment, uh, IODP in general, where everyone is trying to really put the, the best that we can do and teach. There is uh, not a shred of uh, envy in a way or, you know, I'm better than you or actually we are all collaborating towards doing really the best science and this is a value that uh, will be missed. This is the only way to get the hard rock and the sediment from the ocean floor. So this is fundamentally important. We get a sample of what really we want to. 
this ship is the only way to get the sampling. If we miss this ship, so we have no chance. This program is totally different from the other science. We have quite different scientific background, stick together and do only our one target. Sometimes find very new things from the very young generation to from the seniors. It's like equal totally equal opportunities and then we discuss intensely and sometimes fighting sometimes we love each other only two months it's many things happening i haven't seen such a beautiful program I see my favorite thing about working on the jr is just the extremely interdisciplinary environment there's not really another scientific environment that you can work in with so many people from so many different subdisciplines of geology with different fields of expertise all working together on the same site on the same samples so it's really eye-opening to see things from everyone's different perspective. I am going to miss a lot of things from the JR. One of the things that I'm going to miss is the anticipation where a core comes on deck. We are all standing outside waiting to see what's going to arrive and this anticipation is really exciting. What I will miss most from the JR is when you're on a, on a working ship like the JR or other uh, seagoing expeditions. You have to deal with whatever comes to you. You're on your own and you have only the help of the people on board. But because you only have the help of the people on board, there is this great feeling of collaboration, of solidarity. Because if a problem comes up, it's a problem for everybody, not just for one person. And what I will miss most about the program is that it's an incredible chance for people to see science going from the very beginning, from grabbing bits and pieces of the earth from deep below the ocean floor, all the way to making some of the most sophisticated measurements that we can make uh, in the world on, on, on these rocks. So to me, that's a unique experience. It's an incredibly grounding experience for somebody who starts in this business, and uh, it will be sorely missed. The JR is pretty much the only tool that we have in the scientific community to get samples and measurements below the ocean floor and losing it uh, is, is a real is a real miss for the whole scientific community. The people is wonderful and uh, you know everybody is very collaborative everybody is very talented so this is very important and everybody is smiling so it means that uh, the things are going well and make uh, myself to smile when I see this and this is really important after that there is you know the food the food is excellent the ships is nice uh, also the sea in some way because we had uh, we were lucky we found a wonderful time wonderful weather and the science obviously so many people with different expertise, they talk with all, with all each other, they discuss, analyze the data is with, with different perspectives. Really, really, it is very stimulating and exciting. And also the data, collect this kind of data, I mean, is unique. So, you know, I'm missing a lot of, a lot of things. IODP is a great opportunity for health scientists great opportunity. So missing the, the, the IODP means that we are not able anymore to plan this wonderful campaign where there is this very nice selection of the proposal that goes toward the excellence. And the rich excellence is not an easy task. Uh, excellence means a lot of work for a lot of people for many years in the right direction. This is not something that you achieve, you know, just putting the money is not enough. You need the money, but you need the people and the right people and training them, them very, very well for a long time. So it's a big loss if uh, UDP doesn't continue.